Hello, welcome to our overview of the international shipment settings in Shipping Easy. To get to the international shipment settings, click on settings on the blue bar in the top, and under shipment settings in the top right, select international shipments. Now this page should be your first stop when you start shipping internationally, as it will help automate your customs information and ensure successful international shipping. The first drop down here is to indicate the content type of your packages. You can always override this on individual orders, but it's best to set your defaults here. I sell commercial content, so I'll choose commercial sold item from the drop down to ensure my customs forms are coded properly. Next, you'll select your product's country of manufacture. Mine's the United States, so I'll leave it as the default. The next space is for a harmonized code, which is helpful for customs to identify the content of your package. We have a helpful lookup tool directly to the right where you can search for the type of items you're selling. I sell shoes, so I'll search for that. And see that my harmonized code would be 640411. I click that and that gets added to my form. Keep in mind this code is optional and you do not have to use it, though some international carriers will require it. The description section will override any description you have listed on your site or in Shipping Easy. This does need to be short, under 50 characters. For mine, I'll simply put shoes. Moving down to include signature on customs form, check the box and enter the name you'd like to use to sign your customs form. This will automatically sign the forms, saving you time and headaches caused by unsigned forms. Last, this is the checkbox to automatically truncate your current product descriptions to the 50 character maximum. This will save you time and reduce errors on the ready to ship screen. Your product descriptions cannot exceed the 50 character limit. If this box is not checked and your description is longer than 50 characters, you will get an error message and the label will fail. Once you've filled out the fields that make the most sense for your business, press save and you're ready to ship internationally.